Hi guys, how are you doing? I hope you're well blessed and kept of the Lord and guys, good morning. How are you doing? I'm not sure if by the time you watch this video, it's going to be morning, but it is. So today I want to make some amazing, amazing breakfast and uh, it's not really making from scratch. So those are basically the ingredients that we are using today guys. We're going to be using some cooking oil, all uh, self-raising flour. We are having some baked beans because they are my favorite. Sugar in that pink container, salt. We have some milk, some eggs there. Uh, these are sausages, classic safari pork sausages. I love pork sausages. And we also have some bacon, guys. This is cola bacon. It's also my favorite. And then we have a tomato that we are just going to cook. So, guys, that's it. So, I'm going to start off with making some tea and boiling the sausages. And then once that is done, we will get started. So, guys, let's get cooking. So as our tea is boiling and also the sausages, we are going to make the bat the pancakes for butter. So that's just some buttermilk and then I'm adding a little bit of oil in there. Once you've added a little bit of oil, put in your salt. Anytime you add salt to anything that you're baking or rather you're cooking that is wheat, salt just helps as an enhancer then i added some sugar eggs in there i'm using two eggs but you can use one or even more depending on how many people you are cooking for so once you've beat in your eggs the next thing we are going to start doing is we're just going to mix it up mix it until everything is mixed up together and then it was too thick so i added just a little bit of water because the buttermilk is a little bit thick then we add our all pop all sorry self raising flour and then just give it a good mix so guys look at that it's perfect it has no lumps and uh, it's sort of runny but it's also thick and as you can see guys i don't know if it's clear but it has some bubbles and that's what is telling you that you're going to be making amazing you know pancakes so i'm eating up two pans and one of them we are going to be cooking our bacon so basically i'm just going to throw in my bacon in that non-stick pan that has some oil i'm not sure if it's really non-stick because i've used it i've had that pan for a while and then on the other end i'm using my chapati pan because it's heavy it brings out my pancakes fantastic guys that pan i use it to make anything <laughs> Anything that can be cooked in a pan, I use that skillet because it's perfect. It's perfect. I use it for my chapati, for my naan. I'm sure you've seen it a lot in this video. So basically what I did, uh, I just added bacon into the pan that has a an handle. And then I'm just going to give it a good stir. I cooked the bacon for four to around five minutes because i don't like it very crispy i just like it to be crispy on the edges and it was perfect so i'm just going to give it a good good mix and let it cook for a while as you keep mixing because as you can see guys it kept sticking on my pan so i'm no longer sure if my pan is non-stick <laughs> But guys, look at that. That's a close-up look. The smell in my kitchen by this time was amazing. And I love, love, love when food in the kitchen is just, you know, amazing. So guys, as you can see, my bacon is ready and that's how I like it. Now, I know there's a lot of debate on how bacon should be cooked, how crispy it should get. But I think if it's cooked, the crispy part depends on you as for me that's perfect that's just perfect so guys look at that amazing right i love 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 how it turned out 
And so guys, forgive me if my voice is rusty just a little bit. It's in the morning. So once I have removed my bacon, remember I told you I boil my sausages and then I blanch them. So those are my boiled sausages. I just added in the pan that I was making the bacon so that we build the flavor, guys. We are all about building the flavor. So basically what I'll do, I'll just toss and turn, toss and turn until it's brown on the outside. But guys, as our sausages are cooking, we are going to start making our pancakes. So just, uh, I normally just apply some little oil on the pan. And then once it's ready and hot enough, and not very hot, and a medium low heat, I'm going to add in my pancakes. That way, guys. So I don't normally spread it, just a little bit so that it forms a nice circle. Once it's that way as you can see we're going to give it a time some time until we see some bubbles forming as you can see guys those bubbles or rather those dots on the pancakes is your hint that it is perfect guys look at that look at that it looks amazing amazing so that's the procedure for all the pancakes and as you can see the sausages are getting brown or rather they are blanching well so i'm going to repeat this same procedure for all my pancakes until all the butter is a finished making but look at that guys look at that it, it just looks amazing i just love love so look at our sausages they are ready and guys something that you will not see is once i removed my sausages i cooked my tomatoes as you can see on that plate and what i did to the tomatoes i just applied some salt and black pepper put them on the pan for a few minutes and then i removed them but in that pan now i just put my baking beans there and i don't normally cook the baked beans because they are already cooked i just like to warm them up and i don't like to do it in the microwave so i like it on the pan to just ensure that everything is the way i want it but guys look at our sausages they look amazing right they oh my goodness this breakfast you can call it brunch breakfast you can i don't know i don't know it's just a way of showing you to have variety once in a while for breakfast but that's how my sausages were looking i think i was overly excited about them so uh our baked beans two to three minutes were ready and i just served them into my bowls i'm sorry guys if you feel like this video is all over but that's how i did it basically it's just a way of showing you how to wakes up a quick breakfast our sausages are ready look at our pancake guys and our bacon my goodness oh my goodness this breakfast just excites me so that's the whole breakfast how it looks and guys does it look amazing i have some leftover veggies for last night and that's what i had them with but that's it guys that's just it that's the whole thing and Thank you so much guys for watching this video. Thank you for watching it until the end. You guys are the best. I love you. See you on the next one. Stay safe guys and peace out.